Look at it. Stuck. Well, yeah. <laughs> What's up, man? How you doing, son? Oh, just a little bit of rewiring. Something burn up? No, no, the oil pressure gauge you bought. Yeah, I haven't had a chance to do any test hits yet, but we'll do that probably Hello. tomorrow. Who the f here? Oh. What's up, big boy? Oh, bring some donuts with you, big guy? <laughs> Hell no. Hell no, why no, not? Because you, you need this heavy ass turd to be as light as possible. Oh, man, uh, was I taking you here to call me out? Yes, sir. Really? It's that time. Really? Yes, sir. Did you bring enough car with you? Because I didn't see enough of it last week. Oh, you didn't? No, I no, no. I seen it. You know, you were beside that gonna... farm truck for a minute, bro. Well, that was all second gear. Good, man. I'm really looking forward to running you, bro. Yeah. What's up, man? Are we going to put any cash on it, too? Oh, uh, you know me. I'm right ready. I, wanna, I took, I took I a thousand get... from them. I figured I'd take at least a thousand from no, them. No, I'm going to get farm truck back his money, bro. So uh, we're going to go not for gonna what, about 15? Cool. Right on. I'm it's good to whatever. go with that. I came here today. I wasn't expecting anybody to show up. It was just going to be me and the kids. And then Eric shows up just out of the blue, call us out for him to just walk in like he owns the place. It, you know, I don't like that. You're a cocky, dude. Oh, yeah. You know, you talk, you get talk back. Oh, definitely. I'm going to hurt you where it counts. What'd you say, 1500 Yeah. OK, and a box of donuts. That'll kill it. <laughs> the money will be exactly. one thing, but donuts will kill his ass. Right. You know yeah. what I mean? We're in. That's, you're going to see the ass in this all night long. Don't I worry, yeah, all night. All good. night. Pin. I'm pretty sure this car has never been as fast as mine. Mm. How do you know? How uh, do you know? It's fixed. It's ready to roll, man. I hope so, because you're going to need all of it. You better put some jet in it. No, I'm with the same tune-up, bro. Same yeah. exact way you see it right now, except for a new oil pressure gauge. That's it. I'll tell you what, though. I might even give you a rematch after I spank your ass and let my wife drive. Cool. I'll take her home, too. Derek's got high hopes, thinking he's just going to roll from the bottom and come to the top. I mean, there's a lot of fast cars he has to go through first, but we're one of them. I've been at number four before y'all even think about getting on the list, so it's all right. I was number one on that for years, dude. Oh, yeah, so. for years. 1990. No. Times are changing. No. You're a cocky that's okay. I'm getting tired of your mouth. I'm That's telling okay. you that. Don't tell me you're tired of it, dude. I'm I'll sick of it. What are you gonna do? What am I gonna do? How yeah. about I punch you in the face? No, I'm standing right here. What you gonna do? Hey, you know, like don't bring my mouth. You walked up to me. Hey. You walked up to me. Come on, guys. I'm gonna drag your ass. We will drag your hey, ass. Drag, buddy. He's very disrespectful, is Derek. He always runs his mouth. He just pushed a nerve. It's hey, all man. about racing. Come on, man. It's about racing. Nobody. You got a how about got this? No, there's a door. You're going to see the ass in this so we can bring it to cash. Trust me. Hey, look, bring it all. Trust me. I can take that one loose, put it there, and then take that where I need to go here. Brian's down here with me working on my car today, trying to get it ready for race Varley, putting a line lock on. Line lock basically lets you pump the brakes up, hold the brakes down, you push a button, you can release your foot off the brake, and it will hold all the brake fluid to the front. So I'll be able to do a burnout, get tire sticky. So you hear old, uh, me and Barley got into it the other day? Where was this at? I went and called him out the other night. He decided he wanted to talk and call me cocky, and I told him I was gonna drag his car just like I did the farm truck. Barley's not the intimidating kind. He's so old, he's more like a grandpa. His ass needs to be in a nursing home instead. Just take him out of the list, and then he's not there to disrespect or talk to or anything. That's what the plan is, anyway. I got 50 says you don't. Come on, now. I already took Chief's money. You want to take your money, too? <laughs> I'm pretty confident racing in Barley, the gold car, because I drive a third-generation Camaro. It's a 1986. It's got a small block Chevy in it with a lot of nitrous. I have more experience how fast the cars are on the street now. Barley, he's always talked a big game, and he's one of them people that live in the past. Well, it's time for the future. I'm going to let my car do the talking. I'll bust Varley's ass. Just go straight to the top. All the way to the top is the plan. If Varley wants my respect, he's got to earn it. He's got to bust my ass. Sorry, Tony's got to bust my ass. Because Varley, he's too old. He can't drive himself no more. Varley will get his ass smooth stomped in front of God and everybody. Weather is a factor, your nitrous pressure is a factor. Everything's a factor with all these cars, and you don't know what's going to happen, so you need to test as much as possible. I don't think it's going to do a very good burnout. My blind lock is making my brakes drag a little bit. Uh, I'm supposed to be fixing that tomorrow, but got to get this thing tested. If I don't, then we don't know where to go from there. The 
the burnout went all right. Uh, I pumped the brakes a little bit, and I felt it trying to grab, so I just kind of rolled out, and brand new tires and sticky brakes don't go together. Drive shaft? Yep, drive shaft. shaft. Up to you, joints. You, one of the cups come out and hit me in the leg. <laughs> There's another one right there. It come out and hit me in the leg. You going to get it? Yeah. <laughs> that hurt. What's that? That's the part of the drive, or the U joint. Snap the out of it. Snap that bitch right in half. It broke. It broke the drive shaft in two different places and bent my diagonal link. Uh, that's. Good reason to test. Don't know what the car is going to do, and obviously it broke. Need all the drivers up here. First up, Barley and Derek for the number nine spot. That would be me, sunshine. <laughs> Dave and I got the car fixed. It's running real good. I should have no problem busting Barley's ass tonight. Derek's making his way up through this list pretty quick. Easily. All right, let's get these cars going. We'll see you guys at the starting line. You got the video? Rules are, you jump, you're out. Even though Varley crossed the finish line ahead of Derek, if he jumped the light, he's out. He's disqualified. So everybody's going to go to their cell phones to see if we can come up with a video ruling to figure out if he jumped or not. He was money. Ooh, Ooh that's close. Ooh, do it again. You get a slow-mo app on that one. If you watch Varley's car, it looks like he jumped. But if you watch the light, it's like dead on. I'm calling it good. I'm calling it good. Tony worked his ass off for that win. He left right on the light, and that's what won him the race. Tony's fast on the lot, baby. Yeah, yeah. On seven cylinders, whipping that ass. Good job. We just kicked Derek's ass, so I'm elated. Tony's elated. He cut a great light. That damn Ford's making some power. We're all happy. The whole crew's happy.